Hello there. Well, you must be Adam Jensen. A keen observation. Mrs. Reed told me you might pay me a visit. And don't take this the wrong way, but you're kind of hard to miss. I'll try to take that as a compliment. She told me you might have information regarding Megan Reed's case and the attack on Seraph headquarters. Oh boy, what a mess. Total pissing match. We had the feds on our ass, orders from three different departments, and pressure from so many lobbyists it felt like being the scrawny new kid in a prison shower. It is a very high-profile case. Mrs. Reed said you thought some procedures were overlooked. You got that right. I mean, you know how it is. Mrs. Reed told me you used to be a cop. There's always cases where you see the lazy officers taking shortcuts. But this... this was different. Different how? Too much stuff got overlooked. People seemed way too eager to jump to conclusions, and every time I was remotely insistent, I got turned down by ranking officers. People wanted to bury this thing fast. That's never a good sign. Surely you have something more substantial than this. Yeah, well, that's where you come in. I got a couple of leads I could never fully investigate. I started poking around, but these government-type agents just gave me the creeps. I, I got scared. Months away from retirement, I didn't want to fuck things up. But you? You obviously have the means to get to the bottom of this. So what have you got? First off, there's a rumor that the order to close the investigation came from higher up. Maybe even outside the local department. Anything like that would have passed through Captain Penn. There might be traces of this left on his office computer. Guess I'll have to pay a visit to the local precinct. Well, yeah, well, while you're there... There was an officer assigned to the case, Chet Wagner. He's not what you call a choir boy. And when he suddenly got brought on the case, I got suspicious. Somebody wanted him there. And I'm pretty sure he tampered with some of the evidence. You should talk to him. Find out what he knows. Okay. I'll have a little chat with Officer Wagner. You'll most likely find him in the lobby. He got retrograded from his conduct, and he takes depositions now. He won't budge easily, but I'm pretty sure you can find some dirt on him on his desktop. His office is on the third floor. He might find something there to help loosen up his tongue. Anything else worth looking into? Yeah. When the order came down to close the case, the bulk of the evidence was stashed in a storage locker. Maybe you can find some interesting stuff in there. It's on the alley right next to the station. The code is 40... 4891. But I know an outside agency had access to that locker, so be careful. Thanks for the heads up. Bah, it's, it's nothing. And, uh, oh, uh, please... Don't bother coming back here with details. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad to help. But the less I know about this case, the better I'll feel. How did you get assigned to this case? I didn't push for it, if that's what you mean. To be honest, I didn't want to get involved. Why not? I was an honest cop, Jensen. I always tried to conduct myself in accordance with the law, with procedures, and what I believed was right. Not really the standard M.O. for a case like this. You said an outside agency may have tampered with a storage locker. What did you mean by that? Well, I've seen, uh, I mean, I've heard that government agents may have locked up some of the more sensitive evidence in a safe inside the locker. Come on, Chase. What are you not telling me? Damn it. Okay, listen. I snooped around that locker before and found the safe code, but I kind of got caught by one of those guys. He knows I know, Jensen. If I give you the code, They'll know I talked. Call me negative, but I can't think of a nice outcome to that. Look, I know this isn't an easy situation. You just retired and you want to enjoy it. I understand that, and I don't judge you. But you have to do what's right. That safe code could mean a lot. I'm an old ex-cop living off a meager pension. While you're an uber-augmented, top-of-the-line agent for a megacorporation that I'm sure pays you very well. Don't try to put yourself in my shoes. It's just plain offensive.
Keep out of this, Hanser. Get lost. You wanna buy or sell something? It's all on the computer. What do you want? I'm a friend of Greg Thorpe. Really? Okay, I give you the egghead discount. Okay, that's it. Hey, Jensen. Long time no see. Uh, you're not here to see Wayne Haas, are you? You're kind of welcome on our turf, pal. Someone's gonna pay! Access granted.
Access granted. Access granted. Hello, I see you. Jensen, I have a message for you, from one of your former colleagues, a Detective Alexander. Jenny, what did she want? She said she could use some help if you could make your way over to Grand River Road. And might I just add, as wonderful as it is to have you back at the office, I am not your personal dating service. About time. You the home sec guy I was ordered to wait for? Tell Manderley I didn't get the memo until I was halfway through the autopsy. By then, it was too late to close him up again. Right. So you recovered the neural hub? Tricky bit of work that was. A few inches lower and the bullet would have fried more than just the pedal connectors. As it is, I can't guarantee you'll get anything useful out of it, other than the fact that it's been modified. Modified? With what? Some kind of wet drive. But hey, I didn't look. Ultraviolet means ultraviolet. And I know how touchy you guys get when it comes to matters of national security. 
He's all yours. The house been detached, but I left it in the skull, as ordered. Now, if you'll excuse me, I got paperwork to fix. Boss, I got the neural hub. Looks like it's been modified with some kind of wet drive. Pritchard should have a look at it. No, don't bring it here. Frank's not finished running his diagnostic, and I don't want to risk connecting any tech to our networks till he's done. Especially if the tech is military. So what do you want me to do? Take the hub to your apartment. I'll have Frank contact you there. Access granted. 